Hello from Kelly Hicks Construction in Sublette, Illinois, where you can get a high resolution video of your favorite trailer on YouTube. This is a 2011 Heritage Glen 290, I'm sorry, start over Cal. This is a 2011 Heritage Glen 312 QBUD by Wildwood. This is the number one retail selling trailer and it's got a lot of fine features that I'm going to be telling you about as I take a tour around it. It's got an A&E one touch pneumatic electric awning. Um, it has the outside kitchen feature, has two exterior speakers, six gallon gas electric water heater. It has the RVQ grill which hangs on the outside, has a ladder rack, has a spare tire, it has a six gallon gas electric DSI water heater, it's got four stabilizer jacks, uh, moving right along here. You've got the extra large door which store, you can fit a large cooler through that storage door. Um, this is under the queen bed, storage under the queen here. Um, electric awning is a nice feature. Roll it in, roll it out with the push of a button. Um, this is a Luma structure. It's vacuum bonded fiberglass, so this laminate is vacuum bonded to the aluminum studs. This has aluminum sidewalls. It's basically immune to hail damage. Um, the Wildwood Heritage Glen series also has a heated enclosed underbelly. Um, this is the outside kitchen feature. It's got a grill here, barbecue or a stove top, cooktop, gas stove here. I had it set up once for the pictures. Kind of hard to set up one-handed, but I managed. There you go. In case you want to do some outside cooking, uh, there is an optional microwave available. I'm told. I don't know why a guy would need two microwaves in one trailer. There's one inside anyway. Um, you've got the porcelain foot flush stool. I'm going to finish my outside tour before we go in. Radius entry doors. There's the ladder rack to get on the roof. All Wildwoods have walk-on roofs. It's got a spare tire. It's got 225, 75 R15s on it for uh, tread. Uh, tinted safety glass window standard. There's the outside shower I told you about early, earlier. And there's the sewage connection water hookup. It's a 30 amp electric service. Going around the trailer. I can tell you again it's a two slide 35 foot camper. It weighs in at about 8,200 pounds. Um, here's the other side of the super pass through storage. It has a 26 inch LCD flat screen in it and built in DVD player. Okay. This is unit number 3379. We sell a few of these each year. It's a good number one retailer. It's got optional bar stools. It's got the dual sink cover. As you can see, this has the stainless steel appliances. That's a new touch that every camper should have for 2011 got stainless steel at home you may as well put it in your camper to boot uh, there's the RVQ grill it's actually called a sidekick grill with hanging rack on the box um, there's the u-shaped dinette which is a double bed that's a double or height of bed with about a foot thick air mattress um, 26 inch flat screen swivels so you can watch it from the bedroom or the living room. That is a built-in DVD player. It's also your surround sound stereo with outside speakers. It's got a sand disc, USB, and auxiliary input to boot. I'll show you around the master bedroom here. This one's the coffee interior, in case you're wondering. It's kind of a tan colored interior. A little green in it. It's a nice interior. It's got the bow PVC flooring, 
that has a two year warranty against any shrinkage or cracks the wildwood all have full ball bearing full extension drawer guides um, it's got a range and an oven here's the cooktop nice to have that fold down so you can uh, have more counter space when you're not using the stove top it's got a range hood nice stainless steel range hood forgot to turn on a light it's got a stainless steel single lever faucet with the pull out sprayer and then we got to go see the bunk room because we haven't been there yet there's some more cabinets in the pantry number one retailer here it's got a twin and a double and a bunk so you could actually stick five kids in here not counting anyone on the floor so this trailer sleeps 11 easily it's got a pocket door you can close them out you can't hear them. One guy I sold this to said he was glad it had the pocket door. Moving on into the bathroom here. As you can see, I left my door open. You wouldn't want to do that and take a shower at the same time. Nice bright bathroom though. I'll go ahead and close that door. You see how good and light it is in here still. Porcelain foot flush stool. Hello, mister. Hello, how are you doing? Good. Just what finishing you? up my video here. Oh, okay. And that will be the end of my video. I have Hello to there. deal with the customer now. Hello there.